Hey guys, how's it going? This is Scott. Welcome back. Hit that like and subscribe button. Look what we found on Mars. Now this, I'm going to take it in NASA site in just a second. This is kind of crazy cool, but there is a mushroom on Mars emerging from the dirt. Now, even scientists, see this is popular mechanics, uh, even scientists have said that uh, they believe photos show mushrooms on Mars. Others, scientists say, no, not so fast. Okay, so scientists have argued this over the years, over many years. And that's just crazy cool because uh, we don't really hear much about mushrooms or anything. But this one NASA close-up image of, a, of an area about 13 centimeters across, from one side of the photo to the other, here's the original website. You can download it yourself. It's in the about description below the video. Okay, this is Sol 398 lens image, okay, so, meaning it's about 13 to 14 centimeters across from a bottom. So this this uh, top of the mushroom measures about one and a half to two centimeters across. Now look carefully. You'll notice that it looks like it's emerged from the soil, that it's pushed out of it, just like a normal mushroom does. Uh, look at the the cap of the mushroom on top. It's, it's very similar to things that we've seen on Earth. I mean, this is a mushroom by all accounts. Uh, it does look like one of those fungal spore things. And did you know that mushrooms, the spores themselves, can travel through space safely. So it's very possible and even likely that Earth and Mars have been seeded by mushrooms through meteorites and stuff coming through. You say, well, it burns up in the atmosphere. Well, the atmosphere there is very, very thin and small compared to Earth's. That's why we're not on Mars right now. So look at that. Look at this. You judge for yourself. Uh, what would confirm this is real or not? Well, time-lapse photography would confirm it's real, uh, showing growth and movement over time. Chemical biological analysis showing uh, the fungus DNA. Well, that certainly would do it too, right? This is just breathtaking to me. It really, really is. Uh, look at the textures, the size. It really looks like a mushroom. And the thing is, NASA totally must have seen this and didn't react, didn't do anything. Now, this is in negative format, so you can see it a little bit different. You can see the light difference under, under and around the mushroom itself. It's kind of unique and strange. The stem of the mushroom is curved on the bottom, just like the stems of the mushrooms in my garden. I have these things growing all over my front lawn, so yes, this looks like a mushroom to me. And what would I do? <laughs> Run it over with the lawnmower. Look, this is something that's pretty significant. And if you could share this video, it would really help me by getting the word out that this thing exists. Life on Mars could exist. And maybe NASA is just overlooking it. They don't want to take the time, the 30 seconds, the five minutes to look at this mushroom more deeply with a Mars rover. Sadly, there was no analysis about it. There was no uh, testing of it. They didn't use that little laser on it to see uh, does it burn in like a rock burns or like uh, a flesh of a mushroom burns. Uh, they didn't do any of that. And they do have that little laser. Remember the laser tracks made in the rocks, in the dirt and everything they've done? They haven't done that with this. They didn't touch it. They didn't poke it. They didn't kick it. They didn't run it over Holy crap, they need to do something with it. So maybe we are seeing life and calling it geology simply because it doesn't fit our expectations. But I call it a mushroom. What's your thoughts on this? Tell me, and I'd like to see it in the comments below. Thank you very much.